welcome to the Emirates Stadium. Uh, today we're doing a full episode. Check out everything going behind the scenes, in and out of the stadium. Checking out the directors area, the Diamond Club, and everything. So the tour starts here in the Arsenal shop. You know where you can buy, you know, merchandise, Arsenal, this and that. And uh, after you've paid, obviously, they give you uh, a little uh, device with, with information which will help you along the tour. And uh, yeah, it's in various languages. You choose your language and uh, then you go. Uh, you make your journey through a series of steps up the stairs and you get to uh, this level here which is uh, sort of the first level uh, it's got uh, a bunch of uh, people to look at notables of uh, Arsenal Football Club as you saw there Mr. Hassan Wenger himself uh, yeah so from the shop actually Arsenal shop you make your way via the car park uh, Thank you. And then you get inside to where we are right now. Not a lot to see here, so you head up it, yeah? to the next level. Uh, from here, which is the um, checking out the director's area, where the directors of uh, the Arsenal Football Club and uh, yeah, the main people go to. Uh, so here we are, that's level 3 and uh, right here is the entrance, we go through this reception I suppose when uh, the directors come, you know, they wow. get noted and uh, they are directed to where they need to sit and stuff like that. It's uh, a very very exquisite. Yeah, uh, this is the director's entrance. And uh, just gonna go and see what's happening in there and see the view from here before we get down to the rest of the beats. Yeah, so this is really cool. Uh, everything is laid out perfectly and uh, I tell you it's amazing to be in this place just look at it you know so this is where they will all come with their get seat lounge enjoy bottles of champagne or stuff like that have something to eat before the game and uh, right here uh, just behind in this little cupboard there is a trophy of the Invincibles, you know, where they went, Arsenal went 49 games unbeaten. And right here is the trophy. And uh, all the names of uh, the players and uh, the main people involved in uh, this season. Uh, as you probably know, no other club in English history in the UK has ever achieved that. So that's a wonderful thing for them. Uh, from here then uh, they can you know so we going through to the actual stadium and uh, check out where the, um, the directors seat uh, those numbers you see like number two number three number those those are just um, numbers uh, to help you with the information um, so week. for example on the app if you want to find out more about what happens in the director's area you go to section 4 that's, that, that's what those numbers are about so right here is where the big guys sit look at the view man the view from here, fam. Look at that. Top 
top. What are you saying? <laughs> oh man. Yeah, so all these seats are numbered and uh, apparently everyone knows where they sit, like the chairman knows where he sits. So uh, whoever so. else they know exactly where they need to sit. And that's for the directors. And when you look at the seats, you know, it's uh, obviously much, much more comfortable compared to the rest of the seats in the stadium. And the view from here is just spot on. It's like bang on in the middle of the stadium, uh, as you can see. And uh, it's just amazing. Yeah, you can see that's like the tunnel right there. And so from here, you know, the view is just uh, perfect to watch the game. Well, on the left side, you know, it's, it's the same really, but um, yeah, obviously the pricing of the seats is different for uh, different sections of the stadium. So I suppose around that sort of middle area section of the stadium, the prices are a bit uh, different. So, yeah, look at the seats. These are uh, different from the ones from the directors. Those are the ones that are much comfy and nicer. But these are good too. Look at this. It's alright. Okay, so from here we move on to the next section up the stairs. And again, um, right here we go to the Diamond Club. I'll tell you a bit more about the Diamond Club when we get there. <laughs> but it's, it's a very interesting uh, view from here. It's also top notch. And uh, apparently, you pay £36,000 to be a member of uh, the Diamond Club and that's uh, 36,000 pounds per year every year uh, of your membership now what that gives you is obviously you know you come and uh, enjoy the games you don't need to pay again to come and watch the game uh, that includes that and uh, you get food obviously drinks and you know, yeah, but it's incredibly difficult to become a member, as I was told. You know, there's a very, very strict criteria for you to be able to become a member of the Diamond Club in the, uh, of the Arsenal football. just seems so well organized uh, at every level you go every section there's somebody to help you out if you need help uh, aside from having that uh, app which explains everything there's uh, also humans <laughs> yeah the people there in case you want to ask questions uh, or you got a problem with your app or something, it's not functioning. Yeah, so this is the uh, Diamond Club area, is it? Hello, mate. What's the Diamond Club exactly? Sorry, I'm not listening. <laughs> Do you mind tell me just briefly, like... So, so Diamond Club yeah. has 168 members. Yeah. Basically, it's uh, season ticket holders. Okay. And they have... Uh, Dean and lunch after the game uh -huh. uh, from Raymond Blanc. Uh -huh. They all they also have a car parking space downstairs. Okay. And yes, yeah, it's a kind of they, they stay with us for a life. It's not just a whole season for this. So yeah. it's, it's not like you can become tomorrow a member. Yeah, yeah. To, to be around for, for a while. You need to apply. Yes, and yes. Is a waiting list how, for ten years. How easy is it to become a member? Difficult. Very difficult. Yeah, very difficult. Like what? It costs 30 to 36,000. Per season or per day? Per, per season. Ah, okay. 
season. And then you can come to all the games. I mean, and yeah, you have to trust you first. <laughs> you, you have to be around the stadium first yeah, yeah, to yeah. get to know you, and then okay, you can take a ticket. Yeah. Ah, thank you very much. No yeah. My What's your name? Anastasius. Anastasius. Nice You're from Spain, right? Greece. Greece. Ah, okay. Cool. Thank you for your help. No worries. Yeah. So there you are guys, you, you heard about the Diamond Club, uh, explain much better than I would have, uh, which is nice, so you get a better understanding. So what's happened to yours now? Look, it's doing this, but because now I can't see what to press. Okay. That's why. Yeah. Um, so we are here in minus one level of the stadium uh, and this is what is here just gonna look on the walls first go and see that it's a quick just history photos of uh, you know uh, press facilities there we'll go there later no we can't go in there it says staff only Nah, so I think we need to go this way and see. Yeah. Arsenal badge is buried under uh, there is uh, lots of items of, uh, of uh, the um, Arsenal former Arsenal legends you know like boots gloves and things like that yeah it says on completion of Emirates Stadium a time capsule was buried here at the players entrance the capsule contains 39 items Yeah, yeah. You can just pause it and read and uh, what is there if if you're interested in that. What's in here? this place for the invisible, the invisible rooms yeah, ah is that the trophy they won or a replica, a replica. yeah the one they won. okay and where's the exact one they won that year it's upstairs. upstairs did you see it yeah it's behind the bars ah i must have missed that is that the one at the director's yeah it's that one it's got the 49 listed yeah yeah, yeah, yeah. that's no, I, th I thought that was just the one given to them to appreciate in recognition of the achievement. That's the actual one. Oh, thank you. <laughs> okay. Wow. Yeah, so as you seen, this is uh, the Invincibles room with all the goodies in it and you've got photo opportunities if you want, you know, take photos uh, here as well. Uh, just to let you know, if you want to take a photo, it's uh, going to cost you, it's going to cost you £12 per picture. Yeah, we're not 
gonna go there yet. Yeah. Just hang on. So yeah guys, this is sort of a tunnel, oh, not sort of, this is a tunnel right here, players come around and straight ahead of us there, they head into the stadium, we're going to go into the away changing room and then head off to the home heading room after. Uh, where should we go first, away or home? Home. No, nah, I think we should go away first. No, away. I want some yeah. yeah, let's let's check out the away changing room, and then after that, we check out the away. Ah, these are interview rooms. Let's let's. Ah, it's this way. Huh? It's the away changing room, right? It's a huge mirror, isn't it? Bigger than ours! <laughs> oh man. Yeah, guys, so look at this. This is the our uh, changing room, I suppose, and nothing to it. It's uh, just what it is. Uh, no jazzies or anything. No, but yeah, the seats are wooden. And. Uh, when they go away to go and leave the, the when when the match ended oh yeah like that and that's why and they take their clothes what they change yeah before into the one and they put it back into the home changing room and then they go all the way back to the away changing room and they get their clothes and put it back on and then after that they have to meet turn back and leave yeah so what's in, what's in here? Ah, hello. Is this the community shield, the latest one? Yes. That they beat Man City. The real one, not replica. Okay. How much is it to um, take? It's twelve pounds for the photo. Four pounds. Twelve pounds. Yeah, guys. So. There it is, £12 and you take a picture with the community shield. Uh, but as it is, you see, so a green screen behind, that means they're going to edit it and uh, they'll make it look so much nicer for you. They probably put you standing in the stadium on the pitch, uh, something like that. And it's really worth it if, if you want to have it. It's magic or that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Thank you, yeah? Cool. What's behind there? Nothing? Ah, cool. Yo guys, so that's the uh, the community shield. Yeah, the um Arsenal's latest trophy yeah uh, look where i am again where, where are we the map of the thing so, um, so i don't know what all of these are hmm. charlie george what is charlie george no idea <laughs> okay so around here is uh the interview rooms where you know you get all the interviews happening i'm just gonna go in one oh i know this place when yeah when they are speaking. Yes, yes, that's right. Like blah, blah, blah. <laughs> Is that what they say? Blah, yeah. blah, blah. Yeah, I guess where I am. Oh, you're hiding there. <laughs> wow. Well, yeah, it's a soundproofed this area. And uh, obviously the sponsors on the wall. And you come in and talk. How was the game like? How did you find the game? Yeah, we outplay them, innit? <laughs> we outclass them, we outplay them. Everything went according to plan. All the players followed my instruction to the book. And uh, yeah, that's how we managed to get the result. 
yeah, fantastic, fantastic, fantastic. <laughs> oh, man. Huh? How was the game? How did you find the game? What game? Yeah, so they are all, you know, small little interview rooms. I don't know how many of them. It's here. It's quite a lot. So okay, there was Sky Sports there, international TV right holders, Premier League production, Premier League productions. It's a lot of them here. Yeah, and uh, just in front there is the main press room you know okay. where the big man sits usually and uh, does interviews and stuff like that you know press conference oh, yeah. there we are so are you allowed to come in here sit uh, just take in the moment enjoy and feel as though you are you know in action yeah. <laughs> it's really nice. It's beautiful, nice and comfy. Wow. I know. Yes. Can you move a little bit? No, you sit there. Yeah, but so yeah, you just get people pretending to be the manager talking or something like that. And are you allowed to take photos here as well? Okay, okay, this way. So yeah, we're going to home changing room. Yeah, look at that. Yeah. Okay. What does it say on the wall there? Discipline, leadership, dominate, compete. Play for the barge, right there. Which one are you looking at? Uh, look, over there. Say so our non-negotiables. This Step until the end. Yeah. Play for the barge. Huh? Yeah. Yeah, the warm up You see those buses? In we trust. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Look at that. That's the bathrooms. That's the bathtubs. Yeah. What's in there? Okay. Okay, there. That's the shower. Okay, so the shower was right there. Voila. Saka. <laughs> Where is Saka? Um, look behind you. Ah, you like Saka, do you? Dad, put this bottle away. I can't hold it all the time. Ah. Yeah, so here you can see clearly the huge difference between the away changing room and the home dressing room. Here is so comfortable, nice and, you know, all painted. Uh, with the jerseys on for each player, you know. Whereas the other side, the away, is so basic. It's just almost, you know, just what you need to sit down and keep your boots, and that's it, really. Apparently, that's done intentionally, you know. Whatever they can do to, off, you know, to make the other team not perform well, <laughs> they did it. Yeah, so that was done deliberately. Um, so here we are.
uh, the home changing rooms looking so fabulous you're allowed to take photos if you wish sit down Go check out the big man's office, isn't it? Yeah, so right after the uh, changing room for the Arsenal players, there is the manager's office. Hello, Mikel Ateta's office. That's, uh... Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah, this is the boss's room. Big man's room. Oops. Yo, so that's uh, Mikel Ateta's room. Sorry, did you say something? Yeah. What did you say? So is this this is the doctor room when they get like injured, right? Yeah, kind of. <laughs> yeah. So they say they will not go. So never go to a football. I don't wanna be a football player. Player. What did you say? I don't wanna become a football player. Why not? I don't want to. That's the gym. Yeah. So yeah, we're done with the home changing room and we make our way to the tunnel. It was just nice to look at all those uh, writings on the wall, you know, it's encouraging to the players mentally, you know. But anyway, here we are at the tunnel. Yeah. And uh, it's, it's amazing the feeling to just to be here walking through this tunnel, you know plane of people have walked this tunnel <laughs> it's just unbelievable the feeling that yeah you know I don't know how to explain this it's just amazing to walk through this tunnel and come out to the pitch every time you watch football you see this and all your favorite players from all over the world you know so that's that's amazing I'm glad I've done that it was always one of those things I uh, yeah, wanted to do. <laughs> so here we are at uh, the peach side. Emirates, Arsenal, Football Club Stadium. <laughs> Look at the, the huge camera there. So now here you are allowed to wander about and that's the good thing with the self-guided tour uh, where you just do whatever you want really pretty much you're not restricted to the amount of time you spend in a particular area of the tour of the stadium you can stay there as long as you want but anyway here we um, wandered a little bit around this section of the tour marveling at the beauty of the Emirates Stadium look at the uh, tunnel from this angle beautiful and uh, yeah also went and uh, sat where the, where the managers sit you know, I think I'm sitting at uh, on in the Ateta's seat right here. Him and his um, buddies who make big decisions, substitutions, and all that. So there we are, enjoying my moment. <laughs> yeah, so it's uh, one of those things you have to do, really. I mean, yeah, why not? Enjoy the moment. So yeah, that's what people do. Everyone really wants to have a go, have a seat around this section of the stadium. We spent some time, you know, around here, 
and then uh, after that, okay. yeah, we uh, we then made our way out. <laughs> yeah. Alright, go on then. My name is Daniel, I'm here on this very crisp but still beautiful day at the Emirates Stadium. That's right. Working in tours right now. Very busy, had my work cut out for me, but you know, for the love of the club, do you know what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah, yeah, put the, the club, heart in, you know, dedication. What's your name, sir? Uh, Big Japa. Big Japa? Yeah, yeah, that's yeah. That's it, sir. That's, that's my YouTube you. channel. Um, where's my bottle? Huh? Where's my bottle? It's here, in your hand. Oh, I can see hmm. that. They were reminding me of the first one I couldn't see. That's yeah. why I put them there. Okay. Why do I have to hold these stuff? Uh, Next, why don't you hold them? Hold what? These. So after the pitch side, that's pretty much the end of the tour, really. Uh, you make your way out back via the tunnel and then to this area which is basically uh, a goodbye area <laughs> so anyway here you get to get your certificate uh, of attendance and mine which is please. nice really is this the end of the tour then yeah so just go through this way and you'll take uh, you all right there. all right thank you very much you're welcome have a great day you too hmm. then from me are you off to the car park uh, this little area so guys yeah this is it like uh, if we come to the end of the tour of the Arsenal Stadium and right here is just our uh, exit and uh, on the walls is uh, obviously the gallery pictures of this and that Yeah, this is the car park. Come uh, back to us. Okay. So that's it. That's it. Yeah, done. Bye bye, everyone. See you soon. <laughs> Say bye bye. Bye bye. Hang on. Yeah, so after the tour, you're given this beautiful certificate and uh, you exit via the car park and on to the arsenal shop arsenal shop i think that's uh, where we started the tour from yeah hello there mate mm -hmm. totally no problem. thank you very much we, ha we, we enjoyed enjoy the, tour. the tour we did Great. yes thank you what's your name Emma. Emma, nice, nice meeting you. Nice to meet you guys. Take care. Enjoy the store. We are open at this store. Thank and, you. Uh, we have a lot of people. Thank you very much. Bye bye. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Here you need a little finger. Yeah. You are there? Yeah, so that was that, pretty much, really. It was an uh, enjoyable, I would say, you know, very, very nice and definitely recommend going to do this. Uh, you learn quite a lot of things. The, the apps that they give you at the beginning of the tour is really nice, full of information and it's got different uh, commentaries uh, you can choose. Uh, I think there's Lee Dixon, there's uh, okay, let's uh, different people as well. And also you get to choose your own language, you know, so you understand a bit more of the history of Arsenal Football Stadium. And uh, yeah, how it was built, uh, about different aspects of what goes on behind the scenes. So overall, yeah, it's an uh, enjoyable experience. <laughs>
yeah so out here is just the um, what you see normally really if you walk around here uh, Terry Henry there statue Arsenal legend Terry Henry and he has uh, barges uh, when they're building stadium you could buy per little amount and they put your name there with a little but uh, I don't know if they do that anymore because I don't think there's any more space around there so anyway that was that and the ticket that you buy for the stadium tour uh, allows you to go into the Arsenal Museum and that's uh, where we are right now so after the tour of the stadium we made our way to the Arsenal Museum uh, where you learn a lot more of the history of the Arsenal Stadium uh, see the trophies and uh, this and that I think a lot of people actually forget to pop into the museum but it's quite interesting I'd recommend going in there you know it's, it's, it's on one floor it's not huge so you wouldn't spend a lot of time there but yeah it's, it's really nice uh, you get to learn and uh, actually see lots of trophies and things you know right there that's the uh, invisibles again golden boot there and uh, that's the trophy where Arsenal won at the um, Liverpool that was that so yeah that's it really guys end of the tour thank you very much for tuning in I hope you enjoyed as much as we did and uh, bye bye for now don't forget to give it a like comment share subscribe and all that always appreciate it bye bye thank you for watching our videos um please like leave a like share comment subscribe as, uh, so please before you exit the video give it all of those things what i just said okay yes you heard it <laughs> <laughs> so see you later. See you later. Bye bye.